Sorry, this is Nicky Rikis. Welcome back to another video. And sorry for that voice crack, but um, anyways, we're doing the top five today. And today's top five is my top five favorite FNAF AR skins. That does not mean like the actual characters. It means like the skins, like Clown Spring Trap, etc., etc., etc. So we're gonna be going through my top five favorite. Before we get into this, thank you guys so much for 207 subscribers. It means the world to me, and uh, let's hope this channel can get to as big as it possibly can be, and I'll try to give the best content I can. Uh, with that being said, this is my personal opinion, so please do not be offended if your favorite is not on this list. If you guys want, you guys can tell me your favorites in the comments below, or hell, even your least favorite, depending on how you feel. But without further ado, let's get into this video. Starting up at number 5, we have 8-Bit Baby. I don't know if this really counts as a skin, but like, I think 8-Bit Baby is super cool. It is so creepy that an actual 8-Bit manifestation is able to kill you now. Because that means, like, I'm, I can't remember what game it was, but in, what, I think it might have been a FNAF VR. But they said, like, something about, like, 8-Bit um, like, creations coming to life, basically. And the, seeing this means that there's more lore to FNAF AR than you think, because now Ape characters can be a real thing. So, my god, this is terrifying. And also, Ape Baby is too adorable. Um, but all around a great character. I'm very happy that Ape Baby um, is a thing. I'm very happy that they're a character in FNAF AR. And I hope you guys like him too, because I very much like him. Alright, at number four, we have Easter Bonnie. I love Easter Bonnie. He is, like... One, I wanted this to happen ever since um, the FNAF merch came out because like, I, I was like, when I held the first piece of merchandise for Bonnie, it was near like Easter when I got my first and I was like, he works! Easter Bonnie, I'm the most clever guy in the world. But thankfully, it's actually, it's a real thing now and seeing Bonnie with white colors is way more creepy in my opinion. I find Easter Bonnie so much more creepy than the original. Like, I love it. The skin is amazing and I'm super, super, super stoked that we're gonna be getting a plush. And I'm gonna be buying one for sure. Speaking of, hopefully my pre-orders finally come in. I won't even call them pre-orders at this point. I call them orders. Hopefully my Security Beach plush is coming soon. Anyways, that was unrelated. Easter Bonnie, amazing, super excited for the plush to come out, and I love the character, I love the idea, and I think it suits Bonnie's nature very well. At number three, we have Shamrock Freddy. I absolutely love this guy. When he was first announced, I'm like, yeah, St. Patrick's Day, finally, we're, like, I was very happy that St. Patrick's Day got one of my favorite skins of all time, because um, seeing how Freddy looks like that, with like the little chain, the hat, it, it's just, it's perfect. It's perfect, I love it, and I wouldn't ask for anything else. I'm pretty sure that was our second s s FNAF AR skin we ever got. I'm fairly certain that that was the one, second one we ever got um, in FNAF AR, but I'm extremely happy that um, this is a thing because a green Freddy, other than virtual Freddy, of course, but like a green Freddy that's like, that has an Irish hat, like, and all that, it just, perfect to me like as if freddy couldn't be any more awesome like come on guys come on all right at number two we have clown springtrap i love this one because they made springtrap even more creepy as if that was already like if the, as if that was possible like he's already creepy as it is because he has a dead guy inside him but now like he has purple hair fused to his suit he's completely white he has a creepy uh lipstick that you would see chop like the fucking weird teeth. Uh, huge hammer, the big baggy clown outfit, the pom poms. Like, he's just so terrifying. And seeing Spring Chap like that, I'm like, if someone doesn't go as him for Halloween, I will be disappointed in humanity. Like, he looks amazing. It lo he is terrifying. And if I see him. In an actual like like in a mod for like FNAF 3 I would totally play that I would totally play that um, but yeah I love the skin I think it suits spring trap really well and that's why he deserves number two on this list all right if you guys couldn't guess number one because this number one is my favorite character of all time as well 
it goes to none other than Freddy Frostbear, my boy. I love this character. He was the first FNAF AR skin, and now that he got a plush, I'm super excited to get, like, 15. Um, but the reason why he's my favorite is not just because he was the first one. Um, it's also... They basically made Freddy exactly the way I wanted them to. I am happy that the original Freddy exists. It's just like it was so such a cool concept that there's a um, there's a Freddy made out of ice. He has like a cool scarf bow tie. Has like those like little um like I, can't, I don't know what they, they are um, the thing on his hat like the fruit with the leaves. But um, then like he has ice clothes over his ears. His whole body is made out of ice. It's and like when he moves, it's so creepy. I love Freddy Frostbear. Everything about him, his color, the way he talks. It's just he's an amazing animatronic. He's an amazing character. I love him to bits and pieces, and that's why he is my favorite. Uh, yeah, and that's why he deserves number one in this spot. And that's going to do it for today's video. That is my top five favorite Finite to Freddy's AR skin. So I do want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys so much for listening to it in the first place. If you guys want to tell me your guys' favorites, let me know in the comments below. Because um, I think it would be really awesome to see what you guys think. Um, also... I, um, yet again, thank you guys so much for 207 subscribers, and that's about it for this video. So I want to say thank you guys so much for watching, make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and if you guys are new, please consider joining the Nerdcore family for almost daily gaming content. I love you guys all, and I'll see you in the next video. Roll the credits!